Hey, what's going on guys? John here, and today I wanted to do a video review of the Modern Full electric hand dryer. So what I wanted to do in this review is go through and I'll actually explain the setup of this, some of the options for mounting it, and then I'll actually show you the unit itself and kind of go through the features. So first, um, the biggest thing I wanted to mention is this unit is actually quite large. Looking at the photos, I didn't realize it was going to be as big as it was. So to give you some comparison, um, here's like a little hand soap container and just holding this up next to it, you can get an idea of how big the actual unit is. So uh, fairly good size in terms of the actual hand dryer. You have an LED strip that kind of comes through here and then there's an arrow that comes down and this will actually light up when you go to use the unit. The cord isn't super, super long. So this is basically giving me about the max length, but I do have a C uh, GFCI here. So works out perfectly due to the, the placement of where I mounted it. I did previously have um, my paper towel roll actually mounted here on like a rod and I decided to pull that off, install this in its place. But what I'm actually gonna um, do is put a vertical um, paper towel roll here for people who maybe don't wanna use the hand dryer. Um, in terms of installation, there's basically a metal bracket that sits in the back here and there's a clip that it then clips onto. The bracket itself has three screws um, that you use to mount it. I used a stud finder to find a stud right in the center of the bracket so I knew that this would have extra support from the stud. Um, you do have an option that comes with the um, small clips that you could put into the wall if you're just going straight into drywall. And then on the back of the unit, there is small holes that screws can be hooked onto. I did actually put some of those screws back here, but I kind of was a little bit lazy about it and I um, didn't end up, uh, these just went straight into drywall and some of them pushed too far. So I'll probably have to take those out, redo them, and ultimately I could have the screws sticking out maybe a quarter of an inch, and that would allow me to hook the back of this on. Whereas you can see here, there's a little bit of play and I can move it almost back and forth. But ultimately, really isn't gonna to matter too much because most people using this honestly won't even be touching it. In terms of the functionality of it, you have a power button here in the bottom. There's basically a big flip switch there. And then the heat comes out of the vents here, and this is the sensor here. So if I put my hand on, you can hear it activate. It then lights up green, and it will actually stay active as long as my hand is under here. If I move it away, it kicks off. So really uh, works pretty well, I would say, you know, given that it is producing heat rather quickly, it's not quite as good as one that you would necessarily find in like a restaurant or a commercial space, but I'd say for what it is, it works really well and it looks pretty nice. Um, I combined it with a little uh, Purell Healthy Soap automatic dispenser. So really nice that, um, you know, got plenty of soap in here. This is fully automatic. I can probably get rid of some of these extra soap containers we had from our house and um, won't e even need to be running through tons of paper towels with this guy. So overall, nice little unit. I think if you're looking for something like this in your home, just bear in mind that it is um, rather large and it will take up some space. We're using it here in kind of a um, more commercial extra bathroom. You can see we have a large sink here and then this is my garage, believe it or not. So we basically have this as an extra bathroom in our garage and I thought this would be something that makes more sense if I had people here working on cars or um, you know, contractors doing things, which was very common this past summer. It makes more sense to have something like this when there's a lot of people utilizing the bathroom. Anyway, thanks for watching and I hope you found this review video helpful.